Hey guys, today we're in Walnut Creek, Ohio in Amish country at the Carlisle Inn. Now we've stayed at the other one at Sugar Creek, but we've never stayed here. So we're pretty excited about checking this one out. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Okay, guys, this is what you're greeted to as soon as you walk in. First thing I'm going to say about this place is it's pretty spacious. What do you think, Bobby? Yeah, there's a lot of room. Looks very clean. Very clean. We're going to start on this side. And this is a huge area. Two sinks. Yeah, what I like is it has a hair dryer. Yeah, so let's go check it out. And you have this really nice big mirror. You can put your makeup on. Or shave, maybe. Got your full mirror to check how you look. Your eyes. Refrigerator does work, John. I checked it out. And that's a main thing. That's that's large. It is. You have an ironing board and an iron. Plenty of places to hang your Coats. Yeah, it's a lot What's of room. What's nice is why one showering one can be on this side getting ready. That is nice. Extra pillows. A little coffee maker. We got some coffees back here. Starbucks. So that's a makeup remover, I'm assuming, correct? Yeah, that's, that's the tally one you usually don't go in there. White one, but, for sure. And go right over here. And it is clean, isn't it? It is. Have some conditioners, some shampoos, body lotion. Have the turn this on. Get that extra heat lamp. Your lights. Plenty of towels for tonight because we're only staying one night. It's a tub and shower combined. Tub and shower combined. It's nice. Nice looking. Mm -hmm. Corners look nice and clean. I mean, I don't see any mold or anything. It's pretty high ceiling. There I am. So you can kind of see it's just straight out. and It's definitely big. I have a plan here in case your place gets on fire. Hopefully it doesn't. But Evacuation mm -hmm. plan. And we saw this on the door. Place keys here. I'm assuming that's when you leave, or if you forget them like me, I throw them all over the place when I'm in the room and I can't find them. I'm afraid if I would put them there that I would forget them. Yeah, it might be just for uh, sure. when you leave. Maybe you just put them there and you just check out. I don't know, but that's different. Now let's walk in here. We got uh, the two uh, queen beds. We wanted a king bed, but. We got the last room in the hotel, so we had to get what we could get. This is your regular room. This room is $179 a night for this time. The country feel with the quilted. How they feel. Isn't that pretty? 
feels nice. It feels good. It does. It's kind of firm, huh? Mm -hmm. Some lighting here. I like this. It's like an old-fashioned bed. Just enough lighting. There's pictures on the wall. Got your phone. Got the charging station back there. You can charge two things at once. There's USB. A lot of here, you yeah, like a lot of lights. Yeah, plus uh, lights on the ceiling. Mm -hmm. And the ceiling is extremely high. Little place to do your work or make your YouTube videos. Nice TV. Yep, and you have a couple drawers. Well, they're not drawers, are they? No. It's almost like a place to put like a, put your phones like a VCR. I'm sure there's not one in there. Yeah, you can put stuff in there, but it's a nice little cabinet. So we had that on that side and another uh, place to sit down over here. Nice end table or drawer in that. Let's take a look. I'm sure there's nothing in it. I got a Amish values book. Right there. Couldn't show it to you yet. Our Amish values. So it's a book, I guess, telling you why do the Amish live as they do. So that's nice. So if you're in this area and don't know, telling you that. Showing you how, what uh, their values are. It's kind of nice to read. And the Bible. But on a nice day, would this not be an awesome view? Let's check this yeah, out. The front the yeah, the front. The back's nice too. But, man, the front's really nice. There's, you wouldn't have a lot of privacy out here. There's the front of the building sign. And look at that. The Walnut Creek. The flowers are still really pretty. I'm surprised because I know, flowers ours are, are dead. Look at the trees back there. You can see some of the still changing colors while the leaves are gone. So this is a pretty good view, huh, Bobby? It is. I like this. Let's go back there and see if we can see that. All right, right there. Look at that. Yeah, I wondered what the front view would be like, but this is probably just as good as the back. Very peaceful. chairs that are back here are really nice so let me just sit down take it all in there we go there's the view you're gonna have this is the second floor so if it was pretty warm because it's only about 50 degrees out here this would be nice to sit back in the evening and just take everything in because almost everything closes at five o'clock here in Amish country so a view like this is worth it just to come home and relax and watch the buggies go by so what do you think Bobby looks nice and cozy it does you know I think it's missing and I don't know maybe they have sweets and they, which they do have sweets maybe it's in it nice fireplace yeah, fireplace would be nice about right now. Yeah, because it's kind of chilly, but it is cozy and clean. We are in the breakfast area. So we wanted to show it to you before there was anything in here. Kind of show you how spacious it is. It's a pretty good size, huh, Bobby? Yeah. Nice okay. chandelier, huh? Yeah, that's really You got more over here. It says it's served from seven to ten. There's your and you ice machine. From six to nine. Yeah, it's big. Got some nice detail in here on the stuff with the plates. Ooh, this feels like you're at home, huh? 
and this is probably locked. If I can go out. No, I can go out. A little wet out here. You can come out here and have breakfast. Well, this is the back part of the hotel. Yeah, let's look at this view. Back part of the hotel. So I don't know which has the best view, guys. There's the Dirt Dutchman over there. Now, I don't know if this goes around. Let's take a look. Ends right there. Big city of Walnut Creek. Very small town. Here is a nice sitting room right by the front desk. The fireplace. Isn't that pretty, Bobby? It's pretty. You could come in here and maybe read, and kids could play on the table with the game games. Or yeah, they could. The yeah, and you could sit out here too. There's your Wi-Fi station. More seating outside. Yeah. Nice piano. What's it say? Probably not for kids to play on it. So if you know how to play, you can play. This is pretty. See the china and stuff inside there. That's pretty. The back side of the Carlisle Inn. There's a chocolate factory right there. So when you come down here to the first floor, lower level, have another sitting room. The Some chairs over there. Yeah, the upstairs is prettier. They have these quilts. Art, I guess. Quilt art. I don't know what you call them. Them all over, all over the place. How much time it take to make that? I know, and there's another one. I'll take you back and show you another one back here. There's your elevator to go upstairs. There's your entrance from the back. There's another one of those. You like those, don't you? Yeah, they're really pretty. I mean, to be really talented to be able to do that. And there's a story that tells how they make them. Time consuming. Just look at all those beautiful flowers, John. They are nice. I mean, they're just everywhere. And it's just getting to be, what, about six o'clock? So it really looks pretty out here right yes. now. Yeah, I can't believe that those flowers are still blooming. I know, because it's 51 tonight. And most, like I said earlier, all of our flowers at home are dead. Yeah, and there's the second floor, which we're on. It looks like there's a third floor up there. Maybe that might be the suites, maybe. Maybe. Not sure. It's not like a, it's a fountain around the front. Man, those flowers are amazing. Yeah, right here. You can hear it. That's nice. Mm -hmm. Could sit out here if it was warmer. Yeah, a lot of seating. More seats on the porch back there. I like the lights look like flames. Yeah, so we have on our house. Mm -hmm. Have a clock out here. Sit out here too. It's an awesome view. Yeah, I think I like the front view better than the back. Yeah. Exiting the third floor elevator is your fitness room. Let's walk in and see it. Nice and cool in here. Well, they have a nice couple treadmills and elliptical. TV. Nice Amish pictures. And probably when you're on here, I'm assuming because it's dark, 
you got a great view of the countryside. And you do, and you can see me. Come around here, has some weights, mirrors, plenty of towels. It's all you need. Because when you're in Amish country, you're definitely probably gonna have to exercise because you're gonna gain so much weight from eating all the good food around here. Problem is, I never come to one of these when I'm here. A couple banquet rooms here. Now this is the smaller one. It says it's a 60 person meeting room. Let's take a quick peek. Pretty good size. Coffee machine, sink. Nice TV. So I guess if you were getting married here, or a small wedding, or wanted a meeting, you have two choices for rooms. Oh, before I forget, I wanna show this little area back here. This little nook. You can buy some Carlisle Inn coffee mugs. Got a quilt ornament. Got all kind of little stuff, little candy bars. But then I wanted to show you this. You can buy a framed print. And the Coke's only a buck out of here. Well, we swung by the front desk and got our snacks. Chocolate chip and snickerdoodle. Try it out, Bobby. And you get these from six to nine. I'm guessing they're made in the bakery at the Third Dutchman. There's a snicker deal. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Is it fresh? It is a fresh cookie. All right. Time for me to try this one. All right. Pretty nice of them giving you cookies. Let's break it down. Let's just break it down and show you inside. A lot of chocolate chips. It's soft. You can tell they're fresh. Oh yeah, you? they're definitely fresh. The snickerdoodle is um, it's excellent. It's got the full cinnamon. Oh. I'm making too much noise, I know. That is good. Snickerdoodle. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Which one do you mm -hmm. like better? <laughs> chocolate chip better. You try, try okay. chocolate chip. That's good, because we share everything. Mm, we do. That one's good, too. A lot of chocolate chips in there. Mm -hmm. I might have to say this snickerdoodle. Okay. We disagree on something, guys. It hardly mm -hmm. ever happens. So we were right about this key holder. It's a quick checkout. When you're ready to leave in the morning, you put your keys there. You put the service please on the outside of the door and you just leave. You don't have to go to the front desk, but we're going to go to the front desk because we have a punch out card that if you stay here 10 times, your 11th time is free. And there's the room rates. We were in room 208. Well guys, woke up to this amazing view. Wish it was sunnier, but still pretty. So now we're gonna take you and show you what they have here for breakfast.
here's our breakfast. And you can see mine's not real healthy. A donut, a cinnamon roll, and icing to put on the cinnamon roll now. When you come here, they're famous for their cinnamon rolls from the bakery. But what did Bobby get? Raisin bread. Raisin bread. And then a strawberry yogurt. Strawberry yogurt. You want to try that, see how good it is? I toast it, Mom. I love the taste of the raisins. They're sweet. I just like bread like this. Cup of icing. Maybe I should get two or three cups of icing. I think one should do you. Look. There we go. Let's put it all right in there first. Probably could have heated this up. I like That's what I was cold. thinking. Mm -hmm. I would like mine more and better. Good. It's fresh. Icing is really sweet. I'm gonna put some more on. Maybe I'll get another cup of this. <laughs> I want to tell you guys something. You get this breakfast, which is all you need. That's all we need because we're gonna go out and eat later. But for nine more dollars, you can uh, eat at the Dirt Dutchman next week for a full breakfast buffet. This is right next door. I don't know. This has so many things. It had the biscuit and gravy, and it had sausage and yeah, I mean, all it's, kinds it's of stuff. Need. I mean, we'll spend a nine dollars. Problem is, if you go there, then how you want to eat lunch? I mean, yeah. We like eating lunch. Got to bring you guys the videos. But pastries. Let's just show this. One. This is a chocolate. Donut. I don't think it. I don't think it has cream. It looks like it has cream in it. But let's find out. I think it was just up against something. Oh. Almost like a ho ho. Yeah. I mean. Chocolate cake donut with cream inside. You've never seen that. And that is definitely fresh. Here's the Der Dutchman. And this is where we were telling you for nine more dollars, you guys can come in here and get a full breakfast. And we have already been here. And I will link the video. In the description and there's the hotel so you thought it's just a quick yes, short it's walk a nice little walk in it yeah it's nice and it's pretty we always like to walk after breakfast or something yeah and we are going across the street to the carlisle gift store now bobby likes this store it's probably got some neat stuff so you can go check out both of them in the mornings all right guys, we're headed in to show you guys just a quick peek of some of their Christmas items. This store's pretty big. I think it's, is this three levels? Um, two or three levels, two three, I can't yeah. remember. But we're just gonna show you a quick peek.
did you think of your stay at the Carlisle Inn here in Walnut Creek? It was really nice. Um, I enjoyed walking around, looking at all the different places that you could set. I especially liked the one with the fireplace. That was so comfortable there. It was. Um, the bed. The bed was very comfortable. Um, hot water. Yeah, it had Very definitely. clean. The only thing was, of course it was 7.30 this morning, so that's not a big deal, but you could hear someone, I think it was a little kid maybe running upstairs, you could hear him. Yeah, But other than that, walking. you couldn't hear anything. No, that because was quiet. Because you even said, it's too quiet in here, I, I can't did. sleep. I like a noise machine, so if you don't like perfectly quiet, you might want to bring a noise machine, because there's no ceiling fans or anything in here. And, there's no uh, microwaves. No, there wasn't a microwave. No microwave in here, so that's important to you. You might want to do that. But the question is, which one would we pick? The Carlisle Inn in Walnut Creek or the one in Sugar Creek? I personally would pick the one in Sugar Creek. Now, they have a pool there. We don't swim, but they have a real nice pool there. Seems a little fancier. They have a theater right outside the door. That's what we enjoy, the theater. Yeah, we go there. We, we usually get a show that night. Have a little store, which we just we walk in and check it out. But uh, they're both nice. Yeah, it depends on what you want to do. Like if you want to shop, you probably want to stay here because of the parking. There's a nice little chocolate store. Yeah, there's a the chocolate street. store here, and there's a you know the gift shop across the street, and you have the Third Dutchman, yeah, which some people love. More down, I guess downtown kind of. What yeah, you yeah, you're downtown here. I mean, I don't know what other shops are up to there, but they both have their. Uh, both have their yeah. benefits. Both really nice. Both are nice. Hotels. They're both nice. So and they're both right around, probably at about the same price if I remember when you check them. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah. So until we meet again, J and B have left, left the building. building. something else now this could be good or this could be bad about staying at this hotel right next door is this chocolate company right here they make it on the spot maybe someday we'll go in here and uh, do a review of this place but we never can leave here without getting something so we'll show them what we got today Bobby Look at that. Chocolate apple. M&M's. M&M's. 1095. 1095. It's a nice size apple. And it smells great in there. So one perk of staying there maybe is you can just walk over here and eat all the chocolate you want. But we try to stay out of here because this could be could be deadly for you. <laughs>